my humble regards to enactus india and a very warm welcome to all the teams that are presenting this year i can imagine the amount of anxiety and the adrenaline rush that you all must be facing right now after this year long journey involving so much hard work sweat and also uncertainty but uh, i think that the one thing that unites all of us is uh, our dedication to create something good for the society and the planet Four years ago, I was on the same side as you all are today, and an Enactus team member. But uh, when I look back at my journey, I'm so thankful to Enactus for giving me the values and also the passion to create change in the society. Today, as an Enactus alumni and also as an entrepreneur with a business in the edtech space. I would like to talk about how we leveraged technology to grow our business and share some of my insights on what the future of work would look like with the fast paced penetration of technology. Now with respect to the business in just one year we were able to build a community of over 10000 children coming from 14 plus countries. and now this all has been possible only with the rising access and affordability of internet we were working from india in a work from home setup with a team of just 10 and that's where technology really helped us now my two key insights on what the future of work looks like with technology are first technology will really help us to create impact faster internet penetration along with 5g coming up will help us to magnify the amount of impact that we create and this is on a global scale let's just take the example of india for now as per a recent survey done by the economic times by 2025 india's 87% of the population will have internet access right now the number is 600 million people and in 3 years it will grow to 900 million people now this growth from 600 million people to 900 million people having internet access is interestingly going to be driven by the internet adoption in the rural areas what this means is that now education healthcare awareness governance everything will be able to reach to a larger number of people and hence have a better impact even when we consider our own enactus projects if right now we are limited to say about a 100 km radius around our campus to work with communities with technology we can work with communities as far as 10000 km away as well second technology will help us take better decisions it will help us collaborate now by collaboration i don't mean online communication via zoom or google meet that is obviously there but collaboration with respect to technology when we use augmented reality virtual reality and technologies like artificial intelligence to virtually create product prototypes get feedback do its testing and also assess the impact of the product beforehand we are able to save huge cost and this will be the future even when we consider our own enactus projects what do we begin with we begin with the need assessment of our beneficiaries of our customers then we look at the product fit in the market all these processes we collect so much of data and now that data can be leveraged for us to make better decisions and this is where technology will really help us lastly technology can never replace humans and human connections but it definitely does stand a chance for us to create better and bigger impact on both the society and the planet once again i would like to thank all the country leaders and actus teams judges and the entire community for their brilliant efforts I happened to look at several of the projects from this year and I must say that I'm impressed to see such innovative, sustainable and scalable solutions from you all. And these are all for the real problems that we face currently, whether it's waste management or pollution. So I wish you all the very best. I am keenly looking forward to the winner announcement. Thank you.